Ciao ragazzi, welcome to my channel. Today I am going to show you uh, how I do my hair, how I style my hair. I just uh, showered and I am, uh, I just combed them and now I'm going to use all the hair products and I'm going to show you and give you my review about the Dyson Airwrap. So stay tuned and keep watching if you're interested. Okay guys, so this is the Dyson Airwrap. It comes in one of these big leather boxes, really pretty. Inside, it has only attachments. So this is like a, like a blow dryer. And then these are all the curling ones. These are the smoothing um, brushes, two different ones. And then this is the round brush. So, I always start and then this is the attachment. I mean, this is like the air wrap itself. So I always start with the, the blow dryer part that I rough, blow dry wrap or something like that, do you say? I don't know. But before I do that, I, I wash my hair, I, put, I use the mask tonight, but I need to use some products so I don't damage my hair from the heat. So today I'm going to use this Shue Mura. Uh, this is a nourishing, taming overnight serum. Even though it says overnight, I use it even like in the daytime, like two pumps of this one. Mm, it smells so good. It's like, I think, camellia. So I'll rub it in my hand and just put it more towards the end of my hair. I have short hair now. And just like put it a little bit all over, especially on the ends very important also because this way your blow dry will hold for longer time and then I'm gonna use this Shuemura hair oil that I love just like one pump not even a full pump like half of a one pump because my hair is very fine and I don't need to use a lot and this is like acts like as a heat protectant and it smells so good and it just like protects my hair. So, mm, love this. And now I'm gonna brush my hair. And I will start rough drying them. Um, I'm gonna keep medium heat and the fastest, I don't know, fastest thing, I don't know. I am gonna switch to the highest heat uh, and I will try, I'm trying to concentrate the drying part on the roots mainly and less on the ends because then I'm gonna go with the ones, so. Okay, so my hair is like, I would say 70% dry. It's, my hair is very fine, so it literally dry, dries so fast. And now I'm gonna use one of the smoothing attachments just to smooth out up here. Oh my God. That's it. And then now, I, what I do, I will um, brush my hair again and then divide them into sections. So first section, and then clip it. And then I will divide this. So I will start with this little pieces of hair like this. I like to use um, the smaller, um attachments if i wanted a more um like a tighter curl or the larger one if i just wanted more volume so i think tonight i'm going to use um the, the smaller ones and then i will just okay then i have my piece of hair and just keep the the dyson in this direction
and then turn it off. And this is the curl. It's gonna fall off. It's, it's not really gonna make my hair very curly, but it's gonna make it like look like a blow dry at the end. It's really amazing. And then always at the end, I like to go on with a cold shot by holding it up because I feel it holds the hair better. Um, and then I turn it off and then I remove the Dyson. I don't remove it while it's going because it messes up the whole hair if I do it that way. So let me do the whole hair. There it is. Okay, at this point, I uh, sometimes I use this uh, IGK texturizing, vol voluminizing texture spray, uh, but I'm not gonna use it today. I'm just gonna show you how the blow dry comes out without putting that, because obviously that's gonna make it hold more. Uh, I just wanna show you like just straight out of the shower how it does the blow dry. So now I'm gonna do the side. So I'm gonna switch the attachment from with the other, always the small attachment, but um, with this side, just get a piece of air. Switch the ones and start with the second. Section. And you know, I just don't have like a specific size of hair that I, a piece of hair that I pick. It just whatever I go with my hands and just like, sometimes it's a little thicker, sometimes it's thinner. So you just have to See, it depends on the kind of hair you have. Voila. Switch side. It might look like a lot of work, but really like it's very quick. And sometimes I don't even have to separate my hair in different uh, sections because I don't have again I don't have a lot of hair and my hair is like fine oh, to brush my hair I'm using this Leila Milani pink brush I love it so good I bought also a mini size for my daughter <laughs> it looks crazy but trust the process because it's gonna fall you see it's already like falling most of it and then we're gonna brush it out and then we're gonna switch side and do the last part and show you the final result did all my hair now I'm gonna go through it with um, one of this like uh, combs I don't know how you call them and just brush through you can also go with your hands you know with your fingers this side because it's the last side I did it's always more curly than this somehow 
but if I want this more curly, all I have to do is just like go back. Even though I like them when they fall, when they fall is just like so much prettier. And then I like to use a little bit more of the oil, just like half a pump again, because this oil is super thick, just like this on my ends, Make it shiny. Hey guys so i hope you enjoyed this um uh, hair tutorial and my review for the dyson i don't know if it was helpful or no if you have longer hair than mine though i recommend using the longer uh, attachments because this um it could be short um so for my kind of hair that i have thin fine hair it works beautifully and it's i've noticed that my hair hasn't been uh the split ends has been like so much better because the heat like i don't know it just works so much better i love the look that it gives me it literally i feel like i came out from the blow dry from a hairdresser uh, with a professional blow dryer so i really love the look that it gives me and another time i'm going to show you how i use my round uh, attachment as well because i do use this also a lot but this is kind of like the more fun part and it doesn't take long to get your hair done um me because i'm filming it took me a little longer but maybe it takes me i don't know 15 minutes to do my whole head uh, it's real quick and it gives beautiful results so thank you for watching hope you enjoyed my review subscribe to my channel if you want to watch more beauty tips and uh, if also if you want to watch this makeup that i have on i did another video that you can go and watch on my channel Ravina Barbuto. so thank you very much see you next time ciao